idea for this project is something that I've been pondering on for a very long time. Being able to ride on Mardi Gras floats is something that I've always dreamed of and I'm just super excited about it. I've been thinking about this project for a while. Being that there's a lot of moving parts to it, I needed some help. First, I needed some floats and a place to ride. So I got in touch with Matt Cantrell, whose family has been building floats for over 100 years. We can position them to Second, after scouting the location, I saw a lot of potential, so I took out my iPad and sketched up a few things and sent it out to my team. Finally, we had to set up the warehouse. We saw that this place was jam-packed full of beautiful handcrafted floats, and we knew that we couldn't ride on all of them. Right now, they're organizing these other floats, hopefully gonna get them more set up after that, we'll get all the bigger floats that we'll be riding on in here, so we'll be able to kind of see what the layout and how much space we're going to have to film. The Jeep's got to be facing this way. You go right there, that's perfect. So I'm excited to see it all come together right now. Sam's up there building a platform, and that is going to be for me to jump onto the top of, and then he's also got a flat rail up there that's gonna grind off the end. So I'm hoping to go up from the ground onto the top of the float and then grind off and land on the landing ramp, bringing me back down to the floor. So it's, this is definitely gonna be one of the bigger pieces for this whole thing. I can put these two together and we don't have to change any ramps. I can hit the wall ride and then immediately come this way and hit this and spin over it. I can do a trick over it. These things can be utilized more than once because I can do more than one trick on them. So right now we're test riding the biggest float where I jump onto the top and come down. We're just trying to figure out like whether we need to scoot the landing ramp back or not, but I'm hauling ass and I'm excited. So I'm kind of overdoing it just because, I mean, who wouldn't want to ride their dream skate park? It's good. It's perfect. Thank you, Ed. Just got here. It's pretty early in the morning, and yeah, I'm excited. Trying things. Yeah. This is my mom. Hi right. there. You know, he rode a two-wheel bike when he was two years old. I tell people all the time, I think he was riding a, a bike in a pull-up. <laughs> These dudes are great. They're like, hey, like we want to add a few random pieces here and there. So like, we didn't plan for me to jump over this float at all until 10 minutes ago. I'm gonna give it a shot right now and that'll tell us if it's possible or not. So <laughs> panning the whole get idea. Up on there and then yeah, so I would kind of like, yeah, I would basically choose that same ramp and then I would hit both tires on that, go doink, and then come down. Let's do that. Let's do that. Oh, oh. At first I was going Evil Knievel and I was going to jump the whole thing, but that seemed to be not such a great idea. So now I'm going to jump up and grind and or ride on top of a ledge and then go back down to flat. Right now we're about to get started on some of the test runs for the last trick of the entire video. It's something that's a little bit nerve wracking for me, but luckily it's a trick that I've done quite a few times, so I'm comfortable with it. Definitely not to this caliber. I would say this is probably one of the biggest ones I've ever done, if not the biggest one. And yeah, let's get it done. I'm ready for it.
Well, Sweet. thank you guys. Thank all of you. This whole project means so much to me, being from Louisiana and being a BMX rider, getting to combine those two things and just seeing the entire process come together and get it all under one roof, it really just hits me right in the heart. Thank all of you guys for being here. Without each and every one of you, I wouldn't have been able to make any of this happen. Without further ado, that's a wrap. Yeah.